Go on. Oh, there's no choice, Mickey Carter. Get her up. Oi! One thing, you plank! Just, I think this is going to be Look at the state of it. I'm ashamed of you. Did you say it, mate? You hurt. Moping around on a bench like a mug. I mean, what are you going to do? Cry? No, don't you get up. Not unless you're going to do something. Don't waste my time. I needed to see if you could handle it before I put you in front of someone real. And in front of all those people, what did you do? Hey, you ran away like a mug. I mean, your wife's got more fun than you, Mick. You're a disgrace. I can see what you're trying to do. You ain't going to get it, though, so... <laughs> no, you know. imagine. Imagine if it went the other way when we were kids. Imagine it if I didn't step in. <laughs> You would have topped yourself after a week inside. I saved your life. And how have you spent it? Running away like a mug. Like a coward mug, me, Huh? How many more times you got it wrong, eh? And you wanted me to smash the geezer up for you? You pussied out. No bottle. <laughs> yeah. Come on, here. Come on, here. Come on. Stay away from me. That's it, go on, yeah, you walk away. Do nothing like you've done your whole life. It's because of blokes like you that kids get molested. You have me going for a minute then. <laughs> oh, Mick Carter, the original dead eye. You still got it, ain't ya? 10 out of 10, right? But can we get back to business now, please? <laughs> Charm the army, forever, mate. I got your back. You got mine, yeah? You did time for me. Yeah, I thought I'd save you the trouble. That's what you're working up to, isn't it? Yeah, I did, but I wasn't going to say it, though. Didn't think I needed to. I'm devastated. Mick. You broke my heart. Mick. Because your name was the very last name I had in the frame. <laughs> <laughs> She remembers everything. She remembers everything. <laughs> Even down to the fact that he was wearing that shirt because Dobson broke his ankle. Why would she know that? Why would she know that? She was just showing you the match. She wasn't there because I bailed her off. Uh, loads of us were wearing our shirts. There were loads no, of there us. There was only one shirt. One shirt she saw by the motor. One shirt she remembers. One number. One shirt with a number nine on it. So what is it then? You like to pretend you want to help people, yeah? You want to protect them, you want to keep them safe, yeah? And then you go and do that to a little girl! Why? What did she ever do to you? Tell me, why? What's the point of you saying anything? You're not going to believe me anyway. There are two sides to every story, man. You know what my chin said? My tenor said, you ain't worth doing time over. Do you know what? She's right. Look at you. Look at this place. These pictures. These people. <laughs> they all moved on from the old has-been. He's a good kid. He don't need this on his conscience. So when he gets back, why don't we just... Remember those stuffies my dad used to keep? Ronnie and Reggie. Yeah. They chased me around the garden enough. Yeah. You rescued them from building site, vicious things they were, feral. And my old man found them, trained them up. Used to make them sit guarding my pram outside the bookies. <laughs> Said he could leave me for hours and wouldn't have to worry because if anyone even thought about coming near me. <laughs> This is priceless. <laughs> Mick. Tommy, Tommy, Mick. Hello, mate. This is Tommy. This is a wind-up. Oh, it's just a test. And from the look of it, we're best off recruiting the missus, eh, hey, Tom? I touched her. You saw it. I could have lifted that top up. I could have touched a lot. But you've let blokes get away with a lot more than that, haven't you? I mean, you your own brother, wouldn't it? And what did you do? You let him cut hair over the road. Your old lady having to walk past his shop every day. I mean, what sort of man lets that happen? Hey, look at you. 
I bet you won't even show her that video. I bet you was awake when I was filming, pretending to be asleep, hiding under the covers. You think I won't do it? I love you, Mick! Uh, I've done her a favour. First time a real man's touched her in years. <laughs> Come on! Come on! Do it, Mick! Do it for her! Phil? Yeah, it's me, I'm here. I've got your first instalment. Let's go on a little sleigh ride. Any last request? Help! 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 Please! No one's gonna come. Just uh, take a few breaths. That's, that's what I'd do. Just. Me. Shh. Don't want to hear your voice anymore. No more bunny. Oh, go. I'll disappear. But then you still be breathing, and I can't have that. <laughs> and your heart will still be pumping, and I can't have that. You know, I, I just, I just can't have that. Six months ago, I would have shook your hand. I would have drawn a line under it. You could have walked away. You should have walked away. And now you can't. You know, handshake Mickey's. He's gone. He's not here. Handshake Mickey's. You know, he's. It's funny they call it prison, but the truth is it sets you free. Because once you come out, you just don't care. What? You... <clears throat> what are you going to do? I'm going to kill you. <gasps> so this is it. This is for everything you've done to my family. Let's make it a fair fight. Prison rules. You know, it's a beautiful thing, prison. You get a lot of time to think. I've had a lot of time to plan, but I'm going to put that filthy carcass of yours. This is you. This is you making me do this. This ain't me being evil, this is pure Mick Carter. That kid I covered for, that I went to Boston for! He's still there, isn't he? Come on! Give it to me! Come on! <laughs> Get up! Look at the state here. Tell Zara! My Zara! Zara! Yeah, I'll tell her, I'll tell her. Zara. I'll tell her I'll be a little shoulder for her to cry on. And we'll get close. We'll get really close. You do understand what I'm saying to you, don't you? I want you to understand. I want it to be the last fault in that sick brain of yours. Me and your daughter. And I'm going to be all over her. There won't be a mark on her body that I won't see. <laughs> I'm sorry. I never touched her. I was Linda. Let me go.
Gabriel. We're celebrating too, we'll have one for her. You ain't gonna believe what's just happened to the dog. Not in there, you're not. You're barred. Why don't you run back behind the old girl, eh? Yeah. Forgot. Halfway. Make sure you don't come anywhere near my booze.